one thing that this project has done greatly is to change the minds, the minds of the people, the minds of the children, uh, in terms of being aware of the environment and how to take care of the environment. The fundamental objective is to connect children to the earth. Other aims are to bring the teaching, bring teaching alive, to build living laboratories for the teaching of outcomes-based education. We actually helped the education system in terms of bringing the practical learning. We learn about sectors, perennial winds, climate, and we plant thick indigenous windbreaks which are needed for the Cape Flats. And then also aims at addressing food security through obviously planting productive perennial species as well as food gardens. Basically we, we implement systems linked to environmental themes that we teach. I love um, planting and like mulching things because it's part of the environment to, to care for them, for the environment and people. We are opening in communities now, uh, workshops that we're running in the school, uh, in the training center, to uh, train communities on how to generate a small income. We've started a market, the community market. That's where communities, uh, the stuff that they learn and the stuff that they have, that they can bring and sell into the market to generate some income. CED is having a lot of requests at the moment from schools all over the country to implement this program. We're working with 26 schools nationally, Limpopo, Johannesburg, KwaZulu, Karoo now, and here. So in order to roll it out more fully nationally, we need, we need a little bit more human power, um, and we need, we need to build capacity in, in nodes around the country.